So must-haves that you need when you're a new graduate nurse, you know we need to have a pen and pencil and highlighters and cute little notebooks that you can put in your pocket. Of course, you know, you know, you know, uh, you know we need our stethoscope, okay? Now, listen, I'm just gonna go ahead for the ladies. When you're working those long hours, um, please be advised that you need to have extra pads, tampons, extra underwear, also a cute little clipboard. So I used to have this cute little hot pink clipboard, which I, I actually still have that clipboard is somewhere around here. And you can open it up and put your papers in there and all your important stuff in there. You have everything at one space. So instead of trying to find a napkin, even though I know how we get business nurses, you just try to grab something and write down, dot, jot, jot down your notes. You can have an actual clipboard. To me, these are very important things to have. Of course, you need a watch and all that. You know, of course, you need your your scissors and all that good stuff like that. Our pockets in, are always so full, right? <laughs> so that's why when I go to work, I always have me a nice um, boot bag. Okay, I have some of everything in there. Food. If you're gonna be working some long hour shifts, especially day shift, baby, listen, I have me some snacks. Now I ain't gonna tell you what kind of snacks to get because I know some people may be into health stuff. You know, I just try to get stuff that. It's crunchy and it's gonna keep me woke and keep me energized <laughs> okay so say you're a nurse and you're a little frigid you're a little shy you're a little bashful you don't know really how to be that like outgoing nurse that stands up for themselves very one important thing I think I know that you need as a brand new grad nurse is confidence okay confidence you walk up in there cause guess what guess what you went through nursing school. You went through all that ish. You went through all them emotions. You went through the roller coaster of emotions. Maybe you did. I know I did. Okay. You slaved on them floors doing your clinicals. Now it's the time to show these people what you got and what you made of. This ain't time to be acting scared. Okay. Of course you're gonna be nervous. I'm nervous when I go do anything new. I was nervous before I did this video and I know what I'm talking about. It's just, you know, it's just a fear of the unknown. I understand that. But, but you go in there and you slay that thing. You hear me? You tell them what's up and you tell them, hey, my name is, I'm a graduate nurse. This is the experience I have. This is why you should hire me. I was an honor roll student. Maybe you weren't. Who cares? These are the awards that I earned in school these are the things that i did something very different that you did while you were out on the floor you know they like to hear about stuff like that they want to know get to know you because they don't know you from adam and eve right so they want to know what kind of person you are this is how you go in there and you go in there confident you don't you're going to be anxious and be nervous but don't let that over overbear you okay don't let them see that like don't let them see you sweat and that first day that you get on that floor or you get that assignment baby you go in there and you kill it because you know it you sat for your boards you sat here and did all that studying and did all that prepping and paid people to help prepare you and you did that you prepared yourself so you know you got this okay so it's nothing like confidence okay when people see me i be like oh girl no you got four miles to feed, five including yours. You need to go up in there and get out your feelings, and this is what you're gonna do. I have to, I have to talk myself up, I sure do. So those are the things that you need, okay? Confidence is number one. Everything else can fall, you, you need, but confidence is number one, because your patients can tell when you're not confident. The family can tell when you're not confident. So confidence is everything. How to build it up, affirmations, remind, reminding yourself who you are and whose you are, Okay?